Hey, what's going on, beautiful family? It's your sister Michelle again. Yes, dropping another video for you all. I wish you nothing but love and like. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. You know how I feel about you all. I think you're amazing. I hope your day today is better than your yesterday. And I know it is because you are amazing. You know how I feel about y'all. That's I'm always giving you your props, right? You know how I feel about you. You're amazing. You're wonderful. Straight to topic, though. Let's talk about the fact that the narcissist puts the new supply on a pedestal. When the narcissist puts the new supply, a pedestal ahead of you, and trust me, they will do that. And if you haven't been through it, I hope you never have to experience it, but more than likely you probably have. When a narcissist moves on with a new person, and now they're putting on this new person on a pedestal. They're even bold enough a lot of times, especially in my situation, I tell you my tea, I was told that the new supply was better than I ever was. The new supply is this person. She's got this going on. She's this and any other. Okay, whatever the case may be, I'm not here to debate it because I know who I am. See, when I first went through this relationship, and I was discarded, I felt exactly like he wanted me to feel. I felt like this person he was with now was ahead of me. I felt the person he is now, he was with now, is getting what I didn't get. We all think that bullshit. We all go through it. I thought, my God, what does this person have more than me? I did everything. I tried everything. I gave love. I gave, I gave babies to the man with a small village. I already had some. I gave extra babies to the village. I was like, what is going on? What did I do wrong? I mean, come on. We question ourselves all day. And I know personally, I was the first one, raising my hand again, right here in the front row, saying, wow, he's glorifying this person above me. Maybe it was me. I know he's a bastard. He looks like a bastard. Smell like a bastard. Bark like a dog. It is a dog. But I'm thinking because of the verbal abuse and the brow beating I went through for so many years, you can relate to it, that they have a way of twisting your own reality and your self-worth that the only thing that it's doing at a certain point is validating them. They twist it so it's only validating them. You lose the true validation of yourself along the way and you don't even know how the hell it happened. I was a very confident woman. I'm back to that now. Hallelujah. But back when the day when I first met the individual, I was a very confident, very secure woman. I was always the person that I was. Um, but when I, after being, being with this individual, I started to believe at the end of all of this abuse, it was somewhat, maybe it was me. Now, was I perfect? Absolutely not. Did I have my moments? Absolutely. I'm a human being. Did I have days that I didn't want to do stuff? I didn't want to talk to his ass. Didn't want to touch his ass. Had a good reason on that. But overall, was I perfect? Absolutely. Hands down. There's no way possible. No, 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 no. Did I deserve that? Absolutely not. And along the way, I lost myself so much that I started thinking what, during the discard and when he went on and started validating this other person above me, it was me. And you will dwell in that space base and it will eat your soul alive because that's exactly what they want for your soul to be eaten by not knowing who you are by second guessing your words by looking at this new person who they're with now thinking they have something over you that you didn't see maybe i missed the mark all of that is strategic it's planned out a narcissist will always put their new supply on a higher level than you because they use that person to hurt you even further and make you feel all the examples I just gave you. That's exactly what it's about. I don't give a damn what they say about the new supply. They can put them on a the pedal. Oh, they got all the money. They got all the beauty in the world and all this and that. But at the end of the day, deep inside of who they are, they only see them as an op another opportunity. Not only an opportunity for themselves, but an opportunity at this point to hurt you even further. To break your self-esteem down worse than it probably already is after dealing with the no good for nothing. One strike have an ass skunk. I said it. You two don't block the system. This is an opportunity to appraise someone else to make you feel like you're down here. That is why they validate and put a narcissistic new supply on top of you. That is why you feel this way. It's strategic. That is why they do it. They will put it in the world. They put it on social media. They're doing all this stuff. They're so in love. The new supply gives them everything they ever wanted and ever needed. But that's not true because guess what? When you were the new supply and you were doing that, the last person was thinking about your ass probably the same identical thing. And we find out the hard way that guess what? We were just a plot and a ploy. So you probably hurt the last person and more than, than likely, no, every single time. A tool to make them feel better about themselves and use us to the core. 
until we're depleted and we're no longer valuable. Everybody that has been with a narcissistic, a true narcissistic person in their past can sit up and tell us all the same story. Now they no longer see value in us. Now we're thrown to the wayside. Now we never did nothing for them and you've done everything. And they're the ones that did everything for you. You should be glad that you're on a pencil. I helped put you on. They, this is what they do. This is strategic. And they put the new supply above you because they're not above you. And the reason why I say they're not above you, it's not because of looks. It ain't because of money or nothing. It's not, not above you because of the emotional situation that we're talking about. No one could ever be above you with a narcissistic individual because everybody is exactly the fucking same. That's the thing I had to understand and I want you to understand. Nobody, I don't care what they look like, what they have. Listen to me, sisters and brothers. I don't care if they got a mansion next to the fucking sea. I don't care if they live in the sea like damn fucking Ariel. I don't give a damn if they in the bottom of the barrel living on Skid Row. I don't care what the scenario is. When you are looking at it, what you are looking at is a temporary situation. None of us are above anyone else because we're all in the same exact box with them. And that is, let me use you for whatever I can use you for. Whether that be for myself or to hurt people before me or after me. You are a tool. You to be used and used only. And if I can get money and a better living situation while I deal with you, well, that's a bonus. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter to me. You're a tool. You're a pawn. No supply will ever be higher than you. It's not even humanly possible. No matter what the scenario is when it comes to them, because guess what? None of us go further than this. We're all on the same even keel. Nobody goes here and then here and then back and here. They say all this stuff out their mouth, but in their mind and their spirit, you're all right here. We're all on the same wavelength. We all can get the drama. We all can get the pain. We can all get the cheating. We can all get the lying. We get all the same, the gaslighting. Every single human being dealing with these individuals, they're right here. Same even plane. And I had to understand that the hard way. And I'm teaching you all that. And I hope you listen to you, sister, because I love you so much. And I want you to truly grasp that there is not going to ever be somebody else that's better than you, honey. Because you're saying all of us are on the same level. The new supply, they put them on a pedestal to hurt you. They put them on a pedestal to make themselves feel better. That false sense of self, thinking they're doing something. That's all that's about. Nobody can ever be better, to, be better than you to a narcissist because everybody is the freaking same Hands freaking down. So when you're worried about it, like I used to worry about it, and I'm sure a lot of you that are going through it are worrying about it, are they doing more? Do they love them more? All these questions that ruminate with us, which is absolutely normal, the absolute answer is no. No way, no kind of way, no sir, no ham, no spam, no peanut butter, and no damn jelly. Listen to your sister. Tell my peanut butter and jelly, they look like a smeared sandwich. Your sister said I love you so much. Nobody is above each other when it comes to that. And they only put a new supply on a certain level to degrade you, hurt you further, and also to make themselves feel a sense of normalcy just for a minute. That's why nothing ever works out for them. And nobody ever works out and nobody's ever good enough. Don't you ever think somebody's above you. That's a tactic they use to make you feel that way. We're all on the same level. But guess what? Here's the thing. We're on a better level than they ever be on. Losing them, discarded by them, are you discarding them? Shit, you already 20 steps ahead and ain't no good for nothing asses. Your sister loves you so much, nobody's better than you.